Welcome back everyone to another episode of Awas, but the first episode of Control. We've yes. never played it, so it's going to be a blind let's play. And I haven't heard actually anything about it, did you? Well, I kind of read up a little. <gasps> People you said... Spoiler is monster! No, not about the story. Not about the story, only about the gameplay. Okay. And they said it's different, but good different. So mm -hmm. I'm really curious about what. Well, the menu looks simple. <laughs> Not really. There's shapes and it's like I a guess. hypnotic thing. Ah, uh, we got headphones. Yes. English, English subtitles. English. Okay. And let's go. I guess no difficulty. So. Enemies will try to flush you out of cover using grenades. Look for the grenade indicator. This is gonna be weirder than usual. Oh. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like we live in a room and there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. The room and the poster. The picture is something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie. Second what is it called? Trench. The prison hmm? movie. The room's a cell and the picture, it's different. For each of us, it can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie, something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Who brought you where? Hello? Anyone here? Well, I guess we look around with the mouse. Is this in the past or what? Because there's an old typewriter thing. Did they have like... Those things? F. Oh, I have to press it. Prohibited items reminder. Okay, I guess we're going in here. Or not? Anybody here? Let's go upstairs. This is in the past because everything's old timey, even mm -hmm. the TV. Research records, Bureau of Expeditures. Oh, look, a famous photo of somebody. Oh, texture loaded. 
head of research, Dr. Casper Darling. Hello, darling. Hello, darling. <laughs> you do it much better than I do. Our bureau at work. From behind. <laughs> that's, that's and someone else here. Director Zachary. Yeah, that's the guy we've seen in the cutscene. Mm -hmm. uh, show you that way. Uh, actually, I think it's Zachariah. Federal Bureau of Control. All these years, I've been looking for them, and they were hiding in plain sight. How do I crouch? I can't crouch. Probably not until they tell me to crouch. Or is there a window here and I don't see it? I think there's a window. Correspondence, security order. I keep expecting something to happen and nothing's happening. <laughs> mm -hmm. I guess that's the beauty of it. Our four reports reminder. Don't even know if this is a horror game or not. I know it has. It's the guy from the photo, the picture. Hey, excuse me. Hello. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's hmm? assistant. What? No. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm out. The janitor, by the way. You work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, it's a hell of it. Dirty work for the axe. Take them behind the sound. Okay. I've done enough night shift loaner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ati the janitor is a friendly face in my book. Better than somebody <laughs> with no face at all. Huh? <laughs> Think about it. No face. But that said, I know what you're thinking. If there's an axe murderer around, that's him. I think he heard that too. <laughs> well, <coughs> I think we've been given a job. <laughs> Game? A different job. Game? Okay. You're weird. Anyway, I like Ahti. Yes, let's check out this place. Oh, wait, didn't we? What? Something's... Off? Strange. This looks like the place we came up... F See? Mm -hmm. There's the thing, and then there's the stairs. And then there's the other but thing. This looks different. The door was over here before, and now it's here. It fucks with you. Yep. Hello. Also, no music, no nothing. It's just like uh. the cell and the poster. I was eleven years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. <laughs> Will you help? Well, of course we're here. That's why we're here. It's like a movie. creepy <laughs> oh, something's happening what uh, engine do they use I don't know directed by Did I lose 
lose you there for a moment. <laughs> you know what's Can on my mind. mind. My baby brother, Dylan. Seventeen years since the men of this bureau okay. took him. Oh, no. I couldn't look left or right. I don't know why. I cannot get in. Hello? My. There's pictures of this guy everywhere. Mm hmm. It's like it's the president. <laughs> French, do not disturb me. Investigate the noise in the director's office. I thought I was here for the janitor's job. Shit. Yeah. Shit, shit, shit. Tab you to toggle to now. The murder weapon? Really? Who wants you to pick it up? She I keeps think she's talking about us. I don't think so. I think there's something going on here. Something we don't know yet. And there goes the poster. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one, ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. <laughs> Oh, look at this place. You must choose to be the chosen. Right. You need to survive, that's what you have to do. Yep, I think you're in Minecraft. <laughs> you need to survive the Russian roulette. Stop speaking gibberish. <laughs> I think they just teach you how to yeah, use him. This is probably a tutorial mission. Mm -hmm. Hello, double uh, V for midi. Come here, you. Oh, oh. oh do -do. Take that. The same gun. Control the gun house. <laughs> Guns strange, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. But it still has a tiny barrel. Okay. Yeah. Now I have a gun. Yep. Yes, you do. Congratulations. Oh. Mm -hmm. Stop it. Oh. Oh, it recharges all by its own side. Definitely not getting any headshots with this. <laughs> We're not in use, yes. We've kind of figured that out. Oh no. Why are you so distorted, mister? Is that intentional or? I like the there. gun though. Odd. It's like a Tetris something. Yeah. Oh! Hee! <laughs> yep. Hello. Uh -oh. More like eek. Oh, it has a gun too. Yep. Come out, come out wherever you are. Bitch. Uh oh. Oh, <gasps> got a bit scared over there. I think they want to teach you even how to die. What is this? What is this? Enemies These store stuff. Health but... elements when damaged collect health elements to restore health. Oh, but I don't need it, so. Okay. What's this? You did actually need it. 
the pyramid spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word and this gun's alive you know what I'm happy happy to be here things have quieted down outside is it safe to go was the noisy outside seems pretty fine see please hello Hello there. You people are floating. What is that? You can't let this happen. 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 You stopped it. You. She looks like a you. very well-known actress. That was... horror. What? Oh. Move away. Uh, oh, I thought he was coming back to life. Mm. I got scared of it. <laughs> Some sort of alarm going on over there. That's the hotline. Secure line of communication. You see that, some good? Guidance. It's very weird. Reach the hotline. Hello. That's the director. Yep. The I guess hotline. we're going for the hotline. That's the dead man. Okay. I know you're gonna come alive. I've seen you do it. Like police officers. Because they were the security guards, I think. They were. That's the right thing, yes. Uh oh. Have to hide. No. Shooting through the window. Uh oh, more. Need to use the gun. Maybe you'll upgrade it at some point. Hopefully. I need health. I need health. Weapon mod. Headshot boost. Ah, Exactly what I said I wouldn't be able to do. <laughs> what? Headshots. Do you hear that silent talking? Up, up. I think that's one of the workers. And I don't. And that's a woman. Does that even give me anything? Apparently. Do uh, I have to kill them? Don't I? What? Apparently, you need to look up more. <laughs> don't be afraid to drop your tiara. I thought Me? that was for looking down. Dinner reservation. Well, if you look up too much, you might just, you know, drop it on the other side. What's going on? Let's work hard. His life is in your hands. Everyone's safety depends on you. Wear a mask. Okay, that wasn't there, but <laughs> mm. that's good advice. Shh, shh, shh. What kind of safe is this you only open with one push of a button? Don't do anything to them. Do they like damage? I don't know, but I don't like the grumbling. Uh, what? That just came out of nowhere and it just dropped in our hands. Uh, so, what? Am I supposed to go here? You're supposed to take something. Am I supposed to close the door? 
Maybe then it will open. Watch your step. Nope, apparently not. Okay. Guess we're going outside then. No, you're supposed to open it so something else will happen, I think. But I can't open it, there's nothing. Some good, not this one, that one. Oh. You didn't see her now, did you? Nope. Why do you have to shoot them? I'm afraid they'll come alive and then shoot me later. Central executive. Okay, let's leave the them be. The sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating mountain. Okay, I think you need to kill them. Over what? and over. So they don't blabber in your ear. That's a radio. I think. It's not doing anything, though. Might be because of the copyright music. Of the what? The copyright music. Remember, I told you there was an option to turn off the copyrighted music. Oh yeah. So maybe the radio played some copyright music and we didn't oh. hear it. So basically, we don't have music. And we have music, but only the thing that the game came up with. I think not anything like known from bands or singers or something. If it sounds good, then I guess it's good enough. You know, maybe I'm just killing innocent people. Well, you don't know that, so... I don't. True. They're going to come alive. Definitely. So apparently you only need to kill them, not the others. Because they have the power to kill you. Haha, <laughs> you missed. Oh, there's How do I get down there, though? Wait, go back. What? I have something there. Where? Over there. Th that's the radio or something. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, maybe through here. Okay, maybe not. Hmm. I don't think we're supposed to just jump down, are we? Can we? Yep. Apparently we were. Second class something. They're stronger than the others. Oh, definitely. Oh, we're charging. Whew. Lost clamps, control points. Give more help. Cleanse the control point. What does that mean? Help okay. me fix it. I think it's this. It's a pyramid. It's odd. Yep. The whole thing is odd. with somebody in here. Oh, what's that? Please, talk to me. Okay, okay. We saw you. D I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody so... Wait, wait, wait. let's not control. jump to conclusions. Pope. Emily Pope, Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. <laughs> I should have lied. 
Somehow, this hostile force, this hiss, that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. <laughs> it seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, okay, I'm sorry, so. I'm talking too well, much. Well, how do you know? The situation is just a lot. Trench is dead. Shot. Ah. I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy. But he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell her about you yet. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Ugh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions, and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. <laughs> She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the Bureau she's a part of. Yes. I can try. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. You know, I don't think Jesse is the only okay. passenger of this body. Are you with me? We did it before. Push the hiss out. Oh, we have to push the hiss out of this guy? Girl? Whatever? Oh, so we can save them, actually. Come on, come on. Did that work? The same thing happened as... It didn't work. The hiss has burrowed too deep. Ripping it out. Rips them apart. Oh well. I guess death by gun or death Jesse, by. Over here. We need to make a plan, Jesse. Okay. I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. I'm gonna tell them why I'm here. Okay, go I'll for it. it. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. That's a town name, Ordinary? The Bureau came in and <laughs> oh, well. the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. 
I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I wonder why. I think he knew this was coming or suspected. I think we have our next mission. Raise the Petron Residence amplifiers. I knew yep. they're what saved us. A few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench. The ghost or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun. An old Bakelite telephone. A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Where is the hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mail room. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. Well, then Tomasi's gonna get the bullet they call the me the director. to the head. <laughs> but that's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Well, but you could be. The Why gun am I chooses here? you. Mm -hmm. I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. Oh, that's the what scares me shitless mm -hmm. is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. Department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. Follow the signs to the mail room. You can get to the hotline containment chamber through there. Good luck, Jesse. See you back here once you have the hotline. Okay, okay. Thanks. Don't we have to carry it? What? No, I don't think so. I think we just have to talk to it. Well, anyway, I think this is a good place to end the episode before we start doing anything else. Okay. So, thank you for joining us on this. Brand new let's play of Blind Control. Let's play, yes. Let's <laughs> play a blind let's play of control. Uh, hopefully you will enjoy this. I am enjoying it so far. It's pretty interesting, very story driven apparently. Yes. Shooting is kinda nice, I guess. <laughs> Not the no, best. Sh but the, sh the shooting is a bonus. Uh, it's always kinda strange when it's in third person shooting. True. Anyway. Comment. Let us know what you think about this. Yes. And like, share, subscribe, and join us on the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.